All right, hey guys, it's C4 Born here, and I'm here at the Gigabyte LAN here at uh, Cal Poly Pomona, and I'm here with the lovely Megumi Expert, also known as Trisha. Yay! And all right, guys, you might know her because she's a streamer. And uh, where do you stream at? I stream on Twitch, um, Twitch TV, and it's Megumi Expert. Mm -hmm. So, what are you known for? What do you mean, what am I known for? I'm known for StarCraft mostly. Mm -hmm. Is that what you mean? Yeah. Okay. And go on, like tournaments and anything, and all that good stuff. <laughs> so, are you asking what I do? Yeah, bear okay. Cups. So what I do is, well, I stream, like you said. Uh, mm -hmm. I have a full-time job, but I do stream uh, after work. I did work for, I guess, IPL three, four, NASL now. I'm doing some work here at the Gigabyte, uh, and I also do Bear Cups. Mm -hmm. What he mentioned, it's my tournaments I host. I've hosted about 50 of them now, and they're for all leagues on both NA and EU server. And the Master to Grand Master one has a hundred dollar prize pool normally. The next one will be 150, and it's hosted, casted, and sponsored all by myself. And it's just my way of giving back to the community to show, like, thank you so much, you know, for supporting me. So, you know, we're a team for all my Bear Cubs. So mm -hmm. they gave me that idea, They're like, hey, can you do some tournaments sometimes? And I was like, sure, if you guys want that. And that's how it started. And now I'm implementing a new tournament that's called Cubs Cup, which is a new 2v2 Masters tournament. Because I feel like a lot of the time the team community doesn't really get enough coverage and love. So I'm trying to spread that love. Okay. <laughs> Why are you so adorable, by the way? Why am I so adorable? Yeah, that, is it in your that, that's your is that natural <laughs> that's your opinion, talent? and I appreciate your opinion. No, no, no. It's not my opinion. It's a fact. <laughs> it's a fact. It's a fact. I don't know. Okay. Well, by the way, how old are you? I'm 26. I just well, I'm born in 1986. Uh, so okay. this year I turned 26. Now I'm pretty sure most of the land is wondering, are you single? <laughs> yes, I am single. <laughs> All right. Okay, go get them, boys. And uh, also, uh, what are your expectations for today? You're gonna have a lot of stuff to do today. You're probably be really busy, huh? Well, the nice thing about it is uh, I get to cover some League of Legends, which it'll be my first time ever covering League of, Leven oh, okay. League of Legends, I'm sorry. And I will still be doing StarCraft interviews, uh, you know, try to ask really game-related questions. Mm -hmm. And so I'll be uh, focusing much on League of Legends, but if there's something that I don't understand that well, I will definitely, um, you know, not be shy and ask somebody who's more familiar. Mm -hmm. So how much experience do you have with League of Legends? So League of Legends, uh, I'm fairly new. Uh -huh. I've been grinding a lot of games lately uh, <laughs> because I usually wake up around 6 for work. So I have been getting no sleep. I've even been sh caught streaming like till 5 in the morning and I took a one hour like nap, nap. and then I went to work. <laughs> I was so tired like zombie mode. Mm -hmm. But I'm really just trying to, um, you know, get familiar with League of Legends just because, you know, I might, well I might be doing some coverage, I can't really say for what. Mm -hmm. and. I want to really respect the League of Legends community as well as the players and you know the audience and I don't want to be just doing coverage for it when I don't really know about it or play yeah. it myself. So that's why I've been really grinding to try to do my due diligence just out okay. of respect. So then what character do you play in League of Legends though? My main character I play is Annie so far because Annie. she has Tibbers, the bear, uh -huh. but, <laughs> but uh, I feel she's getting me bad habits for Dota because I play Dota, I'm oh. starting Dota as well mm -hmm. and <clears throat> I feel Dota, the last hitting is, you know, more difficult because there's denying and mm -hmm. so forth. And there's less mana. So when I play a Annie, because her Q option gets her that mana back, yeah. I feel like, you know, it's kind of cheap. So I'm, it's rigged, yeah. huh? it's so so I'm learning bad habits, so I don't want to do that. So I've been playing more AD characters like um, MS. Uh -huh. uh, I try, I'm try. i trying Ryze and so you forth. Should play, you should play Ash. I think you'd but be Ryze a good Ash. I'm sorry, Ash? Yeah, you should try Ash. Uh, you look like an Ash person. The, the problem is is that I play with all people who are ranked, so mm -hmm. they're all level 30, oh. and I'm only, I started that when I was only level 1, mm -hmm. so m many of my games I play, they're all level 30 or really high, and they said that it's difficult for me to last hit being AD because yeah. everybody has runes and I don't, yeah. but I don't care, I like, I want to just be thrown right? into the fire and uh -huh. just learn is, you know, I want okay. it difficult for me. Also, I think you'd be really good at Ari too. You look like Ari sort of actually. Do you know who Ari is? No, I don't. You don't? She's a foxtail, the fox girl. She's got so the... I look like a fox instead of no, a no, bear. No, like, no, she's a cute fox. She's a hot fox. <laughs> Are you calling she's me a, a fury? She's a foxy fox. <laughs> she's a feisty fox. Is he calling me a fury? A furry? Furry. Oh, fury. Furry. <laughs> I don't even know. I'm sorry. I, I don't know that community that well. I just discovered what it was. I was like, what is that? A and furry? the like, people dress up as animals? animals. I don't actually know too much about it either. Yeah. So it's that's like why it's a unknown... furry? A furry? Not a furry? Yeah, it's called, I think it's called oh, okay. furry. I don't actually know too much about it, but you know, people... <laughs> I don't know I don't either. know, people like animals, so I can't argue with them. Do you have pets? 
I do. I have a dog. <gasps> you have a and her oh. name is Kuri-chan. I call her... Kuri means Kuri. chestnut in Japanese. Oh, and I okay. call her that because her colors are like black and brown. Uh-huh. And she's a miracle dog because she came... Someone like abandoned her on things so I found her on my front door on uh-huh. Thanksgiving of 2009 oh. she was only like four weeks old and cold and dirty and shivering and we took her in oh that's so yeah. sweet of you and it that's happened very when it was like tough too. time so it was uh-huh. good oh okay so kind of like a gift from God and everything and uh-huh exactly okay what kind of mix is it I think it's a Pomeranian mix but I'm not uh-huh. too sure on the actual breed. I didn't get okay. the DNA test I need to show you my chick magnet because my chick magnet is really cute too but we're gonna do that in the middle okay of chatting at the same time. Sure. So is there anything you want to get thrown off your chest right now? Because obviously, there's probably some sponsors here to give you a bite land. You got anything you want to like, any shout outs you want to give out while I find this adorable doggy? So, uh, as a sign say, there's Cool Master, there's Gigabyte, obviously, Red Bull, mm-hmm. Twitch TV, my personal favorite. Thank you, Twitch, for all that you do and giving mm-hmm. streamers like me and you know all of your viewers, your favorite players, your favorite teams, the opportunity to do what they love. Uh, also, what is it? Swift, we have TT Sports, Dolby, Cyber Power, CSN, and much more. You have really good memory. It was hard because you did it off the top of my head and uh-huh. no one really gave me anything yet. Yeah. So he put me on the spot, but luckily I can name some. That's pure talent right there. <laughs> okay. And also, here's my, my adorable chick magnet. He's right here. He's a Yorkie. Oh, he's really cute. Yeah, do you like Yorkies? I do. You actually that dog reminds me of Justin Wong, Wong's dog. Justin Wong? He's from the fighting game community. He's like the best. Oh really? Yeah. The best? Oh, okay. I actually don't know that much about the fighting community, so unfortunately I wouldn't know too much about him. Now also I caught you at MLG Anaheim. Yes. Alright, now that was a pretty sick event and also we saw Broodboard Pros there. Yeah. Did you, okay, did you have a background in Broodboard? Uh, a very heavy background. I okay. played a lot of StarCraft 1 and then I played Brewdor all the way until StarCraft 2 came out. Uh-huh. So okay. I love StarCraft. So I started like in the year of like 2008 playing Brewdor. How about you? I don't remember whenever oh, right. it came out. Because I have two older brothers. So oh, yeah. whenever they bought it and they got me into games. Mm-hmm. And that's why I have such an influence. Like I may look girly, but I play all these games. But and you're a manly watch. man deep inside. <laughs> you I guess to, if you, you would like to order it. Yeah, frame. sure. You have a big yeah. muscle. Look it, look it. Holy damn. That vein right there speaks to me. Yeah. But it's only for show. You can't touch. If you oh, touch, okay. it'll deflate. Oh, yeah. okay. Well, that makes sense. That yeah. happens to me too a lot of times. Mm-hmm. But I, I have big guns also. <laughs> now, since you're going to League of Legends, what do you think of the bounce so far? It's probably more bounce than StarCraft 2 because it's, you know, you can just throw out a you know, constant amount of characters. But there's really no way that anyone could be useless except for, uh, except for Eve. You know who Eve is? Evelyn? So before I comment on this, I don't think I have the right to comment on it because I have no real idea uh, that familiar and even so even if it was about Starcraft I'm still not good enough mm-hmm. to comment on it about balance I think only if you're at that really really top you know not even one percent like you just have to be a top Korean player probably or some foreigners can probably have a valid argument on balance but uh-huh. I feel people who are not at that level that applies to Starcraft or League of Legends don't really have that right to talk about balance. So, so what she's really <laughs> trying to say is that Protoss is overpowered so I like his translation, so if that's what you take from me, then yes, <laughs> sure. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. But also, you're a Terran player, right? Mainly Terran, but Mainly. I play all three races. High five. I, I played a lot of uh, Protoss and Zerg before mm-hmm. IPL4, and I did that in preparation so I can do good interviews, and so I have been off racing quite a bit. Okay, that's awesome. Yeah. That's very nice of you, too, and that's also a really big challenge. Like, there's almost like no way, there's no way, okay, first of all, it's almost impossible to master one race. And trying to master three races, like what lead did you get into those two other uh, other, other races? Two of them masters. My my Protoss is diamond. Oh really? But I only think it's diamond, not because like people are gonna be like, yeah, because Protoss so hard. It's just because I played that the least. Oh okay. I, I find I find my play style to be better for Zerg mm-hmm. than even Terran because I'm uh-huh. really greedy player. Uh, Me I ex- too. Expand. Yeah, I'm just very macro oriented, so. Sometimes I'm like, oh, I got to play Zerg, but it's okay. <laughs> okay. So if you were a unit in StarCraft 2, what would you be now that you've played all three races? I would either be a drone, a CV, or a probe, and that way I can Smart. make my own Good universe, choice. Right? Because you never want to be a Zerging or a Zealot, because you're the first to go. Because I'm a creator. Why would I want to be anything oh, but a creator? Oh, okay, okay. See? See, you for think me, of the big picture. I don't think of the big picture. I think of it right now. If I were a unit, <laughs> I would be a ghost. 
a ghost, a ghost and why? because those are so awesome. First of all, they snipe stuff, they kill stuff from far away. They EMP Protoss and make, you know, lots of Protoss tiers and anything. 